boarded the train for Central London from the airport. London Paddington. Never booking a red eye flight again because um, I didn't get any sleep. Yeah. Do you have any worries? How was the flight? Horrible. <laughs> Why? Horrible. Why? You pulled my neck. <laughs> Don't care. You didn't give a fuck. And you're so jerky. You're just like. <laughs> and the whole time, like rustling. Oh my god. It's like a kid, yo. I can't. I'm too tired for this right now. Turn. Cut the camp. This is our very first cheap buddy. Very first. <laughs> mm hmm. So we are on our way to a pub and then we're gonna get Indian food after. Um, you know. But look at this view. Look at that. We're entering Soho. Oh my god, bro. These motherfuckers don't play. These dudes don't play. I can't even. It Look at that. We eat in the shoe. The menu's huge. It looks absolutely delicious. Yo, this chicken tikka masala is so good. Oh my god. How's the lamb curry? Yo. <laughs> Rice right now. Yeah. We need rice right now. <laughs> this was the best Indian food I've ever had in my life. Like, hands down, by like, I don't know how I'm gonna have Indian food again. Like, infinite folds. I don't know how I'm gonna have Indian food again back when I'm in the US. Like, it's decadent. Like, it is, it was amazing. <laughs> Our day one recap. How Not did you breath. like today? Today was good. Today was good. Better days to come for sure. This morning was a little difficult since no, we were. Today was really rough. Since we were uh, jet lagged as hell, very cranky. Mm -hmm. I was very cranky. She had to deal with a little bit of that, but she was also a little bit cranky too, right? I only got cranky because you got cranky. Oh, here we go. Anyways, but um, yeah, go ahead. No, yeah, we were, like, so sleep-deprived the whole half of the day. The first whole half of the day felt like a dream. Like, felt like a dream, and then... It was, like, one of those times where it's, like, everything seems like it's going, like, a million miles per hour, but at the same time, everything's standing still, and it's, like, torture. For me, at least. Like, I was sitting in department stores while she was shopping, and it's not that I had a problem that with you, that you were shopping. It's just, like, I was so tired. I was literally falling asleep, like, while I was, like sitting there waiting for her mm, and yeah, every time oh my i opened God, my eyes so it felt bad. like you know it felt like 30 years had passed but then i look and it's like you're still looking at the same shirt i'm like <laughs> i'm gonna fucking kill myself like this is horrible <laughs> it's taking so long but yeah then we got back checked in Nap. at three yeah napped our hotel room hotel room is like just like show the ceiling bit like it's like really nice. It feels like a uh, Victorian. Oh, it's kind of messy. But yeah, it feels like a Victorian, you know, kind of room. Um, it's very small. First of all, whoever designed, you see that little thing with the crop it right there in the center of frame. That's the freaking, uh, what's that called? The um. I've the had room it key. before in hotels where you have to put in the key. To, Never have. Um, like activate the light never have stuff. i thought the lights were were not working this morning yeah so we thought the lights were working but i was like oh, that makes sense um but yeah it's uh, it's not bad i just wish the tv was like in front of us you yeah know? they put the I tv like... in the corner for some reason so we got we took our nap and then we went to we went to the shoe we went the to shoe. horse and groom first the oh no shoe. after and have yeah we went to the shoe the Shoom was the Indian restaurant. Oh my god. It's the best Indian food I've ever had in ever. my life. Uh, it's crazy. I'm probably going to come back to London just for that. <laughs> really? 
I want to like take it to go home on the flight. I don't Sometimes. know if you can do that. Yeah, I don't think you can. So yeah, that was day one. Yeah. So we'll be back tomorrow. Day two. Mm-hmm. Oxford colleges Sunday roast meeting your friends. Yeah. So we'll see how that goes. Mm-hmm. Alright, I would literally missed like all the pretty parts, but we're in the center of Oxford. Oh my god, it's beautiful. That's B Oscar and Matt and Brandon. I've never wanted to read more in my life. This is the most insane street, not street, like little pathway for something called the, uh, what is this called? Something Tavern? Toad's Tavern or something? Look at how beautiful this is. Look at, look at the, look at the scenery. Oh my god, it's like a off the beaten path type thing. Goose foot, roast potato, Yorkshire pudding, seasoned greens, roast potatoes, cauliflower cheese. Are we going out? Yeah. Um... No, not at all. Got fish and chips, and we got some lamb Sunday, Sunday roast. lamb Sunday roast, half chicken. I don't know what you got. Another Sunday roast and a veggie burger. <laughs> All right, got your stupid sausage roll. Looks like a computer store. What do you have to say? It is great, but it's literally just bread and sausage. <laughs> it's literally bread and sausage. I would want sausage. It's pretty good. That's it tastes like milky. It tastes like chocolate. Yeah. That's too milky. But like, it just tastes like straight up lint chocolate. Okay, in a first. Bar. This is too sweet. Though. How did you like to say? It was great. We walked a lot. 17,000 plus steps. Yeah. Um, so that's like probably around like eight miles. Probably eight Yo, miles. It was too much. Like, it was good. It, it, was, was, it, was, it was good. It was good. Amount of time. Yeah, like, but, but my fucking. <laughs> my feet, my legs, like my tendons. Like, I felt like I was going to die. She's not, you're not used to walking as much, so that's why, but. Yeah, I'm not it was used good. to walking that it was, much. It was good, though. Yeah. It was definitely good. Oxford it is beautiful. Us. Oxford is really nice. We left at 10 30, went to Oxford, saw all the universities. Felt yeah. mad intelligent, the birthplace of knowledge. <laughs> Not really, uh, but definitely one of like the oldest traditionally like scholarly places we've yeah. been. <laughs> scholarly, right? No. Yeah. Um, went around. We went to two pubs. Walked the river, uh, the banks of uh, the Oxford River. Uh, had some G and T. Yeah, and then planned our day. I met. Um, can I name them? Yeah, you can name them. I met B, Matt, and uh, Oscar, all of her friends. Great people. Great times, great memories. What else do you want to say we about We also today? befriended, like, um, oh, yeah. some British locals yeah. on the train. All right, two huge bucket list items were checked off for me mm-hmm. for, for the British trip. One, I had a traditional Sunday roast, which was at a pub yeah. called the, ta- uh, what was it? Something Tavern? Oh, I don't remember. Tower the name. T- I don't remember. I the was name like either. so, like just out. We of were it. exhausted the yeah, whole day. I was, like, hungry. We kind of woke up half asleep, half asleep, whatever. But it was good. We had Sunday roast. I had lamb roast, um, and tried some of the, uh, the beef roast. But it was great. Um, and had some like ale with it, so that was good. And then we, she had fish and chips. They literally serve you like a big ass piece of fish. Yeah, they literally, yeah. And then what else? What else is there to say about that? Oh, and then I had a Greg's uh, sausage roll from Greg, so that's another bucket list item to check off. And tomorrow is the very and in- highly anticipated full English yeah, breakfast. Tomorrow is gonna be we're gonna explore like all of the most the busiest parts of London, like the Proper quintessential, London. yeah, quintessential yeah. London. Like, I'm excited for that. 
Yeah, tomorrow's yeah. going to be a crazy day. Tomorrow we're trying jelly deals, which I'm really excited for. I know you're not really that excited, but I'm so... No, I'm not going to eat it. Like, I'm not going to eat it. You're no, I'm not. I'm so... I'm a, you have to for the no, memories. No, no. We're going we're gonna to take it on video, too. You will. I tried 57 proof gin. Yeah. No, 114 proof gin. So 57% yeah, yeah, yeah. alcohol. So 50 so that shit on its own was isopropyl. Yeah. It was crazy. Purell <laughs> in a fucking glass with ice. I had no idea what to expect from Oxford, but it was really potty. Like, I was sad that we wouotn't get to see the Cotswolds, which is like the really cute like old houses, but Oxford was literally like that, so yeah, it was bigger it's much bigger than i had I had anticipated for sure <laughs> so we're here at forty five germ 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 street mm -hmm. nice. We wanted to come here for English breakfast, but English breakfast stopped at 10, 10 a.m. So we're getting lunch. Um, we got we're getting caviar and risotto um, and rare bread. Okay, look at no, 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 I don't want you have to try this. The spoon is like this beautiful ivory, too. I don't know, that's not ivory, it's like opal or some shit. It's like a shell, it's basically like a shell. I don't know if you can see. Buckingham Palace. I know. Shepherd's pie. Right here, the shepherd's pie. <laughs> I'm a meaty guy. <laughs> oh, you're carving into like a birthday cake, my guy. Yo, Oscar's out here hitting on all the servers. All right, cheers. But our clotted green. <laughs> cheers. We're in a hat shop because Brandon wants a flat cup. I'm not sure. <laughs> You think so? Yeah. Try it on a few. I like it. Uh, I'll buy it. You're gonna buy that one, Donna. Okay, can I just double check? Yeah, put it on, put it on for the camera. Right it does feel comfortable, yeah. yeah. It, it feels perfect. Yeah, I don't have any. They make a so, gown. I'm gonna brush it for you first, right? my dear. Oh, okay, brush it. I'm gonna get it out. Down or up? Up. Tell me a little yeah. bit about hats. Or maybe a bit down. Maybe like a little bit down. Just brush? But yeah, they make their hats at a workshop. Like two hours away from here, so these are all like you know, okay, made and made. Hey, look at me. <laughs> we got Oscar here, we got Hannah, there she is, the beauty. I'm the beast. I'm the <laughs> Look at that. We're walking from. We got the two hat boys right here. Exactly. We're walking from here. Get in frame, because I used okay. need to be in it. We're right. walking from um, from where were we? Shakespeare's Globe. Shakespeare's Globe. Yes, and we're going to Leiden Hall Market, which is a 24-hour uh, covered market. Um, yeah, it's gonna be good. It has a bunch of unique shops. I don't know if they have them there. We can look for Emmanze. It's pretty close by. Jelly deals. 
Here you go. <laughs> Gonna try some jelly deals. This is the Leiden Hall market that we just said that we were going to. Beautiful place, covered. The architecture is beautiful. This is 700 years old, established, well, 701 to be exact. It was established in seven, no, 1321. So, very historic shopping market center. It's cool. So I was in a restaurant and I was having fish and chips again, but I don't know if they like do takeout here, like or like to go bags. But I asked for it to go, and apparently it came in this cute ass like cardboard box. And apparently I can't open it until I'm home because it like opens out like a plate. <laughs> cute. Why don't you kick it off? Kick us off. Day three wrap up about fourteen. <laughs> What? What? Why are you laughing? No, it's like in the back, like a podcast voice. What do you mean, not like a podcast voice? Like a radio Mother voice. Mother. Um, walked a lot today, about seventeen thousand steps. Her ankles shot. Her feet shot. Yeah. Um, we drank a good amount, but we probably walked yeah. off the calories, so that's always good. Uh, let's see. What is the first? We didn't get to try jelly deals. Um, the morning, the day was off to a slow start. I didn't get to try my English breakfast. She didn't get to try her English breakfast. Um, we did, however, have caviar for the first time. Well, not for the first time, but like sturgeon caviar, like the fancy shit with like heavy cream and stuff like that. Probably the best bread and butter I've ever had. Yeah. I'm trying to think of where else I've had like that bread and butter reminds me of somewhere else, but it was like, it was good. It was delicious. Yeah. They are sneaky though. This restaurant was sneaky because on Google maps, there wasn't any like, um, pound signs to like basically show how expensive the restaurant yeah. was before we got there. But like right so. when I walked in and I saw the hosts, like, well, I saw the interior and then I saw the hosts in like the suit and fancy ass, like I was like, Oh fuck. I'm yeah. Like, and then he was like, you know, he, they did like, not want us there. I guess like we didn't dress. We were dressed. This is how we're dressed. Okay. She's wearing like a, like a crop thing. I'm wearing like a t-shirt. That's it. Yeah. Like we were just dressed for a day out. And then, um, I was like, oh, you here for like lunch? I was like, yeah. Or no, like, we, were, we like, were like, well, we wanted English breakfast. Like, are, we, are you doing English And breakfast? he goes like, we stopped serving that at 10. And I was like, okay. Mm -hmm. So, and then we we're like, okay, uh, can we get lunch? And he was like, yeah. And then we, he said, no, he, no, he was like, do you, he was like, so do you want lunch? And so, then he said, we, you were like, yeah, you were like, yeah, we want lunch. But, um, it was good. We, it was kind of embarrassing cause, uh, but basically in the don't morning, like she was, no, don't tell him about that. Okay. Um, to a hat shop. yeah, I got a flat cap, which was awesome. Felt very British. Oscar got his, uh, Sinatra. As you can see, we're pretty tired. Um, went to Shakespeare's Globe, rode uh, a river bus on the River Thames. Awesome time. It was good. Good stuff. Very relaxing. I could sleep on that fucking bus. Seven pounds for one stop. Yeah. Little ridiculous, England. Little ridiculous. It's kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy. Like, no, it's like $10 yeah. for a fucking, for one stop. It was like a five minutes on the bus. Yeah. Meanwhile, in New York, you could go around the whole city. Like, it, it's based yeah. off distance, like how far you go. In New York, yeah. it's just a, a flat fare of 250 and you could go around the whole city, the yeah. whole island of Manhattan. No, transportation overall here has just been really Very expensive. expensive. To the point where Ubers are actually- Ubers are so cheap. Yeah, because I was like, yo, how long is this Uber ride? It was like a 20-minute 20 like 20 Uber minutes. ride for 13 pounds. Yeah. Meanwhile, on the train, it would have been like the same shit. So it's a little crazy. Tomorrow is going to be an exciting day. Tomorrow, we're flying to Scotland. The lands of the kilts. <laughs> yeah. I, I remembered, like, we were talking about Scotland on the trip. I remembered, you know, on my, we were talking about, like, like, uh, my DNA, or 23 and me, 23 and me. 
And I took a My Heritage test and I got like one percent Scottish. <laughs> that shit's lying as hell. That shit's lying, but okay. Yeah, it's like probably an error, but we're going we're to her visiting motherland. My motherland. <laughs> okay. So it's good. So, scenario. We just got to our hotel, Oscar. They're fully booked for the night. This man's gonna sleep in the shoe closet. The <laughs> yeah. closet. Oscar, you know, should wait? Did we tell him that he had COVID? Yeah. Okay, Oscar has COVID. Um, and he needs to stay longer. Obviously, he can't get back oh to the U.S. Oh my god! Um, so. We are so looking, like trying to help him find an Airbnb so he doesn't have to, you know, <laughs> sleep on the street dude. tonight. <laughs> I'd say money. Dude, can I find a hotel? Is that... <laughs> if you want, yeah. they're going to be way more than that shit. They're going to cost you an arm and a leg, bro. It's going to be out here. No, hotel might be cheaper. Just find a hotel. That one's only one thing. So we're at afternoon tea. Um, it's been a bit of a rough morning for... Especially Oscar, who's now gonna stay here for an extra five days and we're struggling to find a place for him to stay. Um, but this is nice. I'm excited for this. <laughs> so Oscar booked a $25 Airbnb. <laughs> But it's like an hour out of the city and it will require like a 60 pound Uber to get there. If you bike, you'll burn 300. You'll burn 9. Oh my god. Bro, yeah, I'm gonna ride a bike 350 with this shit, right? Literally, it's cheaper if you take the bike there. How the fuck am I gonna take a Take the bike there. Don't even fucking, don't even fucking dock it anywhere. Don't <laughs> don't dock it anywhere and just bike back to the city the next day. That'll literally be cheaper. I was gonna put this big ass suitcase on a bike. You not think about that? Oh my god! You not think about that? The man is just gonna be biking one arm like this. He's just trying to hold up that. <laughs> You ever seen like those those clips from like 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 you know India or like Thailand or Vietnam where there's like a motorcycle and there's like six guys on one bike like a family of people on one bike that's gonna be you with this luggage and backpack. We've been wandering around the stores and we made it to Piccadilly Circus, like the Times Square of New York. Beautiful. 